after a week, the previous problem came back. The, the idols fluctuate up and down again. So we don't know what's the problem. I tried uh, to detect a leak again to see this is a carburetor cleaner. I sprayed uh, around here and uh, the revolution didn't change. So we don't really have a leak and I also tried the problem. So what happened is still the coolant system has a problem. And I all of a sudden I noticed right now you don't see but the inlet, this pipe, the black one. Which pipe? This pipe. This pla black pipe and this pipe collapsed. Right now it's not collapsed. One engine is running, it's warm. This is, a, is, is this a shape. But when it's collapsed, meaning there's a vacuum inside the cooling system. That vacuum is caused by this cap. It was was dirty. The way the system works is when engine is warm, this coolant is, has a more, so the coolant flow from this into the overflow container. But when engine is cool, it will suck this coolant back into this. So because the cap was a, a bad one, the coolant cannot return back to the radiator after it's cooled. So that was the cause of the idle because Honda uh, is really sensitive to the coolant system. So what I did, uh, you can either replace this cap, it's about $10, or what I did was just rinse it. The way you rinse it, remember, is look at this, there's a two seal. One is this main seal, that's a seal. The black one? Yeah, black one and the, the biggest one. It's the main seal, so the coolant doesn't come out of the radiator. But this seal is for the returning flow. See, I can... Uh, there's a, another spring here. So make sure you open this one and rinse it well. Mine was all gunked, so I had to really uh, clean it. It's working now without a new one if there's a again there's a problem I will next thing I will replace this that's a tip 